the current system that we have to produce dairy products and cheese is very, very unsustainable. This whole industry today is pretty much broken. It's emitting lots of greenhouse gas emissions. It's responsible for a lot of water and land consumption. And we use a lot of antibiotics into this industry to keep up with the high demands and the big production. And what we're solving with Formo is that we can have the same products without the downsides. So instead of scaling a industry that is broken, we come up with a new way of doing things that is sustainable, that is ethical, and that is also healthy. Formo is a biotech food company that is producing real cheese without the cow. Spending time with the family around food was really one of the most beautiful things we did as children. I grew up in a Swiss-Brazilian family, which obviously has a big influence on the kind of diet that we were growing up with. A lot of dairy products, but then also very meat-heavy. Cheese is an amazing product, it really brings this kind of indulgency, these emotions. Cheese makes pretty much everything better. It's a bit counterintuitive for someone from Switzerland with also a Brazilian part of the family to be on a plant-based diet. I've been on a plant-based diet for six and a half years, mostly because of ethics, sustainability and, and health. For me, it was perfectly clear that it's not going to be the solution to ask consumers to sacrifice or get rid of all those amazing products by themselves, but actually the strategy or the approach to get there to create a more sustainable food system in, in my mind really had to come from innovative technology. The idea of combining science with food technology is just an amazing thing to do. So I love the idea that I as a biologist can actually make something tangible. What I do has a direct impact on how we consume food, how we produce food and who doesn't love cheese. <laughs> I met Raphael online actually through LinkedIn. My husband and Raphael had a job interview and by the end of it my husband said like you know what I know a person who would be much better qualified, my wife. And so then Raphael and I had a chat and we immediately noticed that we click, that we have the same vision. Formo is a biotech food company that is not like the solutions that you would find today in the market that are plant-based, so based on you know cashew, coconut and so forth. This is real cheese. It doesn't come from a cow but is exactly the same. To produce milk proteins in microorganisms, we had to look at the genome of the cow and we identified the genes that are responsible for the proteins in milk. And we used those genes and bring them into the genome of microorganisms to give them the genetic information to produce the milk proteins. We then grow our microorganisms in small-scale fermenters and we can extract the milk proteins from there. Our products contain milk proteins that have on a molecular level the exact same structure and amino acid sequence as milk proteins from a cow, which means that they have the same behavior in cheese products, they melt, have the same nutritional value. Our products will be vegan since they contain no animal products. The cool thing is that because on a chemical, organic or molecular level, this is really the same thing. So what comes out is a cheese that we all know and love, very indulgent, functional and great tasting. We were looking for chefs that had a similar vision as we have. And Ricky really stood out for the very fact that he's worldwide the first fully plant-based Michelin star chef. He was very excited because that was something he's never seen before. He told us that this was something that was missing for him in his cuisine sometimes, the specific texture or the richness. And so when he came in, he was really intrigued, first and foremost, about the texture, which is very different from anything that you would see that is based on plants. Animal agriculture, it emits more greenhouse gas emissions than the whole transportation system. Dairy is responsible for 4%, which is roughly equivalent to the whole aviation and shipping industry. If you look at one kilogram of cheese, you can reduce the greenhouse gas emissions by 70-75% using our process. My hope really is that we can replace as many cows as possible in the system, that we can get rid of as much greenhouse gas emissions as possible. Biology is incredible. We can build a better world by using nature. I'm Britta and I'm co-founder and chief scientific officer of Formal. My name is Raphael Wolkensinger. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Formal. <laughs>